Good morning. It's uh, Friday, August the 28th, and we're getting ready to go to town. We need some uh, gasoline in the truck since we uh, went to Charleston and back. So we're going to go get gas. here at McDonald's. Before we can fill the tank up, we got to fill Larry up, so he's getting a large tea. You got 31 cents um, on the rest of them. Gas is 207 here at Murphy's, so we can get the chicory someplace else. We're back here at Walmart. Naturally. Can't come town without coming to Walmart. We're here at Shell. Larry's getting gas for the chainsaw and the truck both. The truck was about half full, but we wanted to just fill it up while it was cheap, down below two dollars. That's we bought for the truck was only a dollar eighty four. That's a good deal. This is our purchases we made at Walmart. I got another uh, blender just to keep in North Carolina so we don't have to haul it back and forth all the time. So that'll be nice. And then I got these very bright slacks to wear. They're summer slacks, really cool and they feel almost like pajamas. And the house dresses, they're just alike. But they'll be cool, probably cooler in shorts. And they were only $7 a piece. I thought that was a bargain. And Larry got a, a mini pie for 25 cents. Let's see, he's already ate that. But I'm going to go put one of those dresses on because it's hot already. Larry's drying off the watermelons he just picked, so there's five more. I don't think I could eat that many. <laughs> good thing we got a big family and friends. <laughs> yeah. Well, they all look good. Mm, yeah. I found where our grapes were going. Larry's eating them. Larry said he had three or four good ones he picked. But they'll be ready in a couple days and we might not be here. Or do we wait for them? <laughs> He's looking for a soft one. Yeah, no good unless you're real good and right. There hasn't been anything eating them, he said, since we got back. Well, next year they ought to do real good. I didn't mean to pick that one, but it fell off. It ain't ready. It's sour. It's hard. Feel it. It says it ain't ripe. Mm. That's not too hard. You can I'll, I'll try it. Take the juice and then spit it out, but I don't think it's ripe. Mm. And then spit the pulp out. Spit the pulp out. Mm. You're supposed to mash the whole thing in your mouth and get all the juice and then spit the pulp out. Now, mm. don't chew it. Mm. It's sour. Mm. You, you're not doing it right. You don't know how to eat mustard ice. you got to put the whole thing in your mouth. Mm -hmm. I swallow the pulp. But a lot of people spit them out. That's right for you. Mmm, mm, it was good. It was? Mm hmm sweet. I'm surprised. They'll, they'll get better than that. Tastes like the Concord ones we used to gr grow at home, down on the fence. Oh, mosquitoes about to eat me up. I guess I better go back in. How come they're not after you? I don't know. I'm a male. You're tough. Probably in. Oh, there's one in my arm. Missed him. This one might be better. Just take and mash the, and bite down on the back, the whole thing in your mouth. Instructions. You just don't know how to eat it. How to eat a grape. <laughs> well, you don't, you've never had, evidently well, you don't know, you don't bite muscadines in half like that. Well, I'll just uh, kill any mosquitoes on me while I'm trying to eat it. There was one around your neck. Was that sweet? Mm hmm. Mm. Better than the other one? There's one. I guess you better go in the house. But they're good, ain't they? Ooh, that was good. Mm -hmm. You're just not quite right. It might take more than two or three days, but 
But not really. Get, maybe really maybe by tomorrow evening? Huh? Maybe by tomorrow evening we'll get a nice hot day well, tomorrow. If it would rain, it might. That would probably help it. There's some dark ones right there. Yeah, but they got to be soft. Well, oh, that one doesn't. No, they're, they're too firm. Those two I ate were good. Yeah. These white ones are sweeter than those. I think that's a little sour. It should have fell off easier. Not sour? Mm. No. Maybe I'll just pick them all and take them to North Carolina with us and eat them on the way. That, that one was good. Try that one. You want to try one? I've been eating them. Mm. For the last couple of days, I've been eating off and on. A little bit. Oh, the floor clocks down there are pretty. Now, aren't those four o'clock there at the end of the garden? Yeah. They'll be even sweeter than that when they're ripe. This is the best crop ever. Yeah. I know how to can grape juice. Oh, you do? Mm hmm. Okay, well, I'm going to go back in out of the mosquitoes. Okay. This must be where Larry washes the watermelons. There's another one. And he gave one to the neighbor. This is our banana tree that's been growing while we've been gone. And Larry's talking about how big that one leaf is. It is huge. But it doesn't stay warm enough for them to make bananas here. But it makes a nice foliage plant. I found a spot for my big picture I bought a while back at the thrift store. It's right here at the end of the hall. I just, it'll now I'll be able to see it every time I go to the bedroom or the bathroom. It's probably a glare so you can't see it, but I still like it. <laughs> It's 7.30, I guess I'll end the vlog. There's a little bit of a sunset there. Just a few clouds. Good night. God bless.